So how does this all work, these, these digital badges? Well, it comes from a spreadsheet. I'm gonna go back to that spreadsheet here that we can download from flippity.net, but we'll share this spreadsheet with you. Um, but how it works is don't change anything in blue. Um, we've already put in links to all these badges across the top. Um, the badge title, you're welcome to change that if you wanna change something. Uh, the badge available, so if I don't wanna make the at-home learning badge, maybe that one is we're in school next year or the end of this year maybe, and I don't wanna make that available, I can just delete the X, um, delete the X, and then those will no longer show up on the page. Um, on the next on the next page over uh, badge information you'll see that this badge the at home learning says completed one week of at home learning awesome our students can earn that um, if you want to put a badge link this is a link uh, that students could be like hey you've earned this badge now you can go ahead and download it so you could add that in there as well um, you'll put your students along the side so if I wanted to add a student say hey a student just came in maybe this is Cindy and she has earned her reading badge, I can just put an X in there. If she's done her independent reading, I can put an X in that one. But let's say, ooh, she's done it for uh, a couple weeks in a row, or she was super awesome, she's increased her stamina or something. You can put a star next to it. Um, she earned the babysitting badge. Oh, that's a great one, yes. We put like five stars. Okay, you can put three stars at most. You probably put more than three, you can't, but there you go, right? So you can put those things in there. Um, let's say a uh, writing, she's doing a good job, but maybe she's only halfway done. I could put fractions in here. Uh, if you'd rather put a decimal, so I can put a uh, 0.25. And it will show that they're they're working towards that badge, whatever that means. Maybe it's a uh, reading stamina for 20 solid minutes, and maybe they have like two minutes, right? Um, beginning of third grade or something, they have two minutes maybe um, before they go squirrel. Um, but we can say we're working on those things. So we can add in um, X's, and we can add in stars. We can add in fractions, decimals, um, whatever you need to. So once I put that in there, I'm gonna go back to my flippity page, I'll hit the refresh button. And now you'll see Cindy is at the bottom. All my badges are loading up. Here comes Cindy, I'm gonna click on Cindy. And now you can see, here it is. She's earned her reading badge. She's earned her grandma of the year badge with a star on it. And there it is, 50% for writing, 25% for math. How You cool got is it that? right on the math one. <laughs> <laughs> you know, hey, this is kind of a way, fun way you can keep track of kids for maybe uh, standards-based grades.